I have this fantastic friend called Kim, and she does these ocean swims. They're about two kilometers long, out in the open water. I think it's amazing. I looked at that, and my initial thought was, my thought straight away was, there's no way I could do that. And then my next thought was, I'm not a good swimmer. So these thoughts, they're actually beliefs about me as a person, beliefs about my identity. I'm saying, I can't do it. And each time I think these thoughts, each time I buy into this old belief, I'm putting myself in a small box. You know, once I think that, I'm cutting off options. There's not many things I can do. But is this belief I'm holding about myself, is it true? Who's saying it? It's only me saying it to myself. And compared to who? Who am I comparing myself against? So when I ask myself, is this belief true? Do I want it to be true? I create more options. Because there's millions and millions of great swimmers out there. So if they can do it, why can't I? So maybe some of these questions are good to apply in areas of your life. I know when I start to be aware of my own limiting beliefs, how I'm holding myself back, how they're creating my reality, I can question it and step forward, move through them. So I hope this has been valuable to you and I look forward to seeing you tomorrow.